Howdy howdy everyone I'm Amit from Mail Smartly Today in this video you will learn three ways to separate emails in Outlook by sender So first of all you have to select your inbox I have multiple email addresses added in my Outlook so I choose this email address and its inbox Now you will see I have multiple email received on the daily basis from different different senders but the point is if i want to separate the emails of a specific sender what i have to do there are technically three ways the first method is you can use your search bar to search it i will copy an email address of a sender like this and i will simply go to my search bar my current mailbox is selected i don't want to change it because i am talking about a specific inbox and simply paste my email address of a, of my sender and simply hit enter in few seconds you will see the all the emails received from this sender are arranged in a manner received date wise the problem is this when you remove this filter that email you have arranged are scattered so this is a not a permanent way to find out or separate emails received from your sender the second method is you can use quick steps i have already created a detailed video on quick steps you will get the link in the description section the quick step is technically a manual process use this quick step road map you have created in outlook will be executed in a second with a single click So I want to show you how you can use quick step to separate emails from a specific sender. So first of all you have to click on the home tab. You will see quick steps here. Now you have to click on this button to expand it. There are already by default options here. You have to create a new one. So first of all you have to name it. I name it separate email. Now add action below that will be performed when the quick steps is clicked on now here you have to first choose an action when you click on this drop down there are tons of options here so you have to select move to folder i'm choosing move to folder because i want those emails received from the specific email address to be moved and separate in a different folder so i select this now the point is i have to choose folder so i have to first select the drop down and here is my folder although i have already created my folder but in in your case if you don't created an folder you can use other folder or ask always ask for folders you can use these options to create a new one i select this folder i further add actions if i need say if i want to mark as read i can choose it if i don't want this other action or anything else i don't want to add it and simply hit finish that way my road map is created now when i select the email like this and again go to the quick step choose my quick step i have created which is separate email and hit with a single button that will automatically move email from my inbox to the folder i have created which is here see the mail is shifted to this folder I can also use a keyboard shortcut to assign this for that I have to again click on the manage quick steps my quick step is there now I have to edit I have to click on edit now here options shortcut key I can also assign keyboard shortcut instead of using a mouse so when I use this these keyboard shortcuts the same action will be executed very easily but there is another problem with this method by default if i select some other email say this and hit the same separate email the email received not from the specific email will also shift it to that folder which i don't want that means i am not getting the exact emails in the folder received from that email address now the third and the perfect solution for this is rules i have created dozens of videos how rules function in microsoft outlook but in this case i will show you once again how you can create a rule to separate emails so first of all click on the home tab in the move section you have to click on rules click on manage rules and alerts 
Now rules and alerts dialog box appears. Here you have to create a new rule. When you click on it, rule wizard dialog box appears. There are a few options here. So the first option is move messages from someone to a folder, which I really want. So I simply select it. Now, when I select this, there are two other inputs I have to give to my Outlook. Apply this rule after the message arrives from. First of all, I have to mention the email address of a person. So when I click on it, the address book appears. In case if your email address is not in this address book, you can simply manually enter the email address here. I have already copied the email address in the first step. So I paste it here. Click OK. Now the email address is added here. Move it to a specified folder. So I have to first click on this specified, which will take me to the rule and alert dialog box. Here I have to select the folder. I select Haro. Click OK. My folder is already added here. Now, what do you want to do with the message? Two options, stop processing more rules and move it to the specific folder. Both are already selected. Click next once again. Are there any exemptions? No, there is no exemptions. Again, click next. Specify the name of the rule. I name it separate Haro. Now, Run this rule now on messages already in Haro. You can check this option if you want to run this rule for the existing email already in your inbox. You can check this box because you want to run the rule. The third option is create this rule for all accounts. So I don't want to create this rule for all accounts. So I have to don't want to check this option. Now simply hit finish. It will take few seconds and your rule is added in the display here now when i click ok it will take few seconds and all the email in your inbox related to that specific email address will be automatically transferred to this haro folder that way you can exactly transfer all the emails or separate all the emails in outlook received by sender i hope you have learned something new from this video please like and subscribe my youtube channel and don't forget to click on the bell icon so you will never miss out any Outlook tips and problem solvers videos I come up with. Thank you and have a nice day.